Good morning. I'm about to head out. We are going downtown for the day and it's gonna take a lot longer than I thought. So let's see. 48 minutes. So I should probably head out now. I'm gonna meet Daphne and Mara for a little downtown cafe hopping day. This is what I'm wearing. And the weather could not be any nicer. Honestly, it's like a perfect, right now it's 16 degrees, so I might be a little bit cold actually. But this top, this from Zara, I got it like almost a month ago and it's the first time I'm getting to wear it. So yeah, anyways, right now it's 16 degrees and it's gonna go up to a perfect 21, 22 degrees. Some people think that's still a little bit cold, but that's like the perfect temperature for me because I really don't do well in the heat. So I think this little cardigan will be perfect because um, it's actually quite thick. It's like a knit material. And then just wearing jeans and taking my tote bag. This week has been uh, a week. I'm happy it's the weekend and even happier that the weather is actually perfect today. I'm here, I'm early for once. So I'm gonna actually head over to the place first and then um, hopefully it's not a long wait but it's like about an eight minute walk. So it's definitely first. <laughs>
but to be future. Here, okay, film, film Liam. Right. on top of my closet or like the shelf in my closet and the camera fell and I seriously thought I broke this camera oh my um anyway I was trying to show you my closet we are gonna embark on this journey together because I have been putting this off for so long that is organizing this closet um I don't know what it is, but I have been feeling so just lazy slash uninspired. Um, and I think it's the way that my closet is organized right now. But then I think the reason I'm so just like mm, frustrated with my closet at the moment is because uh, there's so many things in here that I just never wear. I feel like my style has changed a lot like even just in the past year i feel like i used to be very much into like just neutrals and and i guess more like timeless or minimal simple clothing and then i think like two or three years ago i started to be a little bit more experimental this is why you should not follow trends and i'm also hoping that this task will help me to rediscover things that i haven't worn in a while to do the closet clear out because um i forgot i had this this blazer is from open for i think i got this mm, i think it's been a while like three three four years ago okay so these i'm just thinking about how i didn't wear this once this fall and winter or last fall and winter um but now that i'm looking at it ugh, part with it just yet honestly this is such a regret this is like the perfect example of why you should not follow trends or be easily influenced to buy something because i've never heard about this brand it's from uh my mom made it i think this may be two years old now it's really easy to just throw on because it's oversized and you know it's really warm for the winter because it's a corduroy material the thing is it was so freaking expensive it was like uh, i think with shipping and duties and everything it was probably more than like 150 dollars for what like it's just so this is where i put all my pants skirts and some dresses 
Um, I feel like there are gonna be more things down here to get rid of.